All right, everybody. We have today boost for Dark Roger. Thank you to Beast OPBR for providing me the gameplay. But there we go. The main EX of uh, the f last anniversary, of course. Uh, pretty OP. Still, uh, possibly number one EX in the game. If not, maybe number two. I don't know. I do really think Boa is the best EX from using her. But. Yep, let's get into the Roger gameplay. Alright, everybody. We have the first game of Booster Roger. Once again, thank you to Beast for providing. Of course, Roger is pretty insane still. There's not really... Honestly, there's really no one that can really destroy him. Maybe, just maybe, Jabra can destroy him with just his damage alone. But other than that... There's not many people. Yeah, see, even Java yeah, barely did anything. But, yeah, Boa, Boa can do something, but he has to be under, like, halfway or something. So he can be turned to stone uh, from when I've used her. That's what I've seen. But definitely Boa is probably the closest thing to a counter he has. And, yeah, he's just insane. Can grab the flag, and there's literally no nothing anyone can do about it. Except maybe another Roger and a few other characters like Treble. But, yeah, he is just an insane EX. I barely got to play him even myself. Not, uh, just like regular maxed. But, yeah. Yeah, as you can see, not even Jabba is doing much damage. I, I honestly thought Jabba would have been damaged, but yeah, he's just healing everything from it. Luchi, uh, I, I honestly wouldn't say Luchi really does damage to him either. Like, he's literally almost unstoppable. Alright, that over should have gave him the flag so he could have got his skill back and stuff. Alright. But yeah, it's pretty, I don't know, it's, he's just insane EX. Probably still the most broken EX they've ever released. We'll see if that changes when... Uh, Garp or whoever comes out next But yeah, just an insane EX still All right, we got this Kizu of course Kizu buffed with the last boss uh, We're getting what is it? We're getting Jinbei Marine Ford Luffy and uh, Roger V1 boss. We'll see if Roger V1 can surpass the V2 But overall, I think uh, attackers are just or the runners. I mean are just uh, unbeatable. Roger V1 may be able to one-shot this Roger somehow or something like that, but still, that probably wouldn't make him better just because running is so important in every meta since, like, let's see, since after Shanks meta, Kaido meta, basically. Of course, uh, before that, it was very important, but... After uh, V1 King came out and stuff, it, it's runners have just ran the meta. But very nice MVP there. And let's see the score. Five and four, pretty good. Alright everybody, we have the second game of Dark Roger. Uh, we are on Sabaody Evening, I believe this map is called. And uh, let's see, they got a Uta, so we, or not a Uta, I mean a Boa. So you can see how uh, he handles against a boa. Which, I mean, Roger overall probably, yeah, will destroy boa, but... Boa definitely could win um, against him. If he can get... Uh, she can get him under halfway or something. Because uh, I'm not uh, sure... I haven't read his traits, but I think how it works is... Once Roger is under half or something, he can be inflicted with status effect. At least that's what I've seen from playing Boa. But yeah, like I said, I barely ever played Roger, really, at all. Just a few times on some mid account. I never had him on an actual, like, good account. But, yeah, he, he is just insane. Definitely the best runner. Luchi definitely does not compare to him still. He may be the second best runner, but Roger still has a giant gap over him, I'd say. Just being able to grab the flag and very few characters can actually knock you off. Stuff like that. Like, he's insane. But I if I would probably say whoever the next EX is, is definitely going to be his straight up counter. EX counter. 
Because Boa, you can say, counters him a bit. Uh, Luchi maybe counters him a tiny bit also. But he doesn't have an exact counter, really, anyway. Uh, other than Kagara and Nolan, but... Uh, let's be honest, no one's summoned for them. Like, they are good, but... They're just not hype enough characters, I'd say. Maybe Nolan, but, uh, yeah. I don't know. In my opinion, they're just not hype enough characters. I barely see them in League Battle after, like, the first week they came out. But they are definitely extremely OP. I'm not trying to underrate them. They are a broken bounty fest. Just not many people own them. Alright, nice uh, come sorry there. Yeah, this, this route is just insane. Oh yeah, Yamato, uh, when I had Yamato and Ace Boost 4, they actually did handle against Roger. Honestly, they're probably the best counter for Roger overall. But yeah, look at no damage that Uta did to Roger. He did have a uh, team boost, but I don't think it would have mattered that much. He still should have gotten hurt a bit. But yeah. Imagine if Luchi could grab the flag while someone was on it. He probably would compare to... Roger, but unfortunately he just does not have that. I mean, I think that, I don't know, this Roger, I think at his time, they made him way too broken, but, alright, let's see the score, MVP once again, pretty nice, and, uh, let's see, 5 and 6, yeah, once you're Roger, you just capture everything. Alright, everybody, we have the next game of Dark Roger. We are on uh, Thriller Bark map this time. Alright, yeah, always on that map. I am so scared to go up those stairs when there's an enemy Roger. So you just get come sorry instantly. It's just so annoying. Um, but, yeah, it, it, Roger is OP. I, for a, se a certain period of time, I honestly did not know his come sorry could go through walls. Like, I, I never knew that. Other than, like, I don't know. When I, I think it was, it had to have been this map I played on first. Someone actually hit me with it. I don't know how I wasn't hit with one through the wall before this, but. Yeah, it took me a while to figure it out. Alright, let's see. Boa actually doing something for once. Nice. Okay. Yeah, Boa is the closest, strongest counter, in my opinion, to Roger. And probably the best DX. Or at least tied with Roger overall, of course. Boa, of course, is OP in a different way than Roger is. But yeah, that Boa putting in some work. Alright. Yeah, see, Boa just keeps coming here. Alright. Yeah, can't grab that flag, especially Ben Beckman here too now. Not gonna let him grab it. Plus, Ben Beckman will have his, uh, gunshot, uh, attack, and then, yeah. Dang, whole team here. Hopefully they split up, because they're about to lose their main, I bet. Someone's back capping. Yeah, someone's back capping them. Alright. Law, I don't think can do anything. Maybe he can do a little bit of damage, but I don't think he can knock him off. Yeah, and see, he can't even hit him. Okay. When he uses his kid attack, he will be able to. Oh, what? Okay. He didn't even get it off. Ooh, nice big meal. Perfect spawning. They're still losing their... Oh, wait a minute. They did lose their main, unfortunately. Alright. Two kids coming up. Okay, team needs to hold it down. Alright. Yeah, he can just keep grabbing this. Kid can't do anything. His, yeah, that one attack maybe do a little bit of damage, like I said. But other than that... He's not, he's not beating Roger in any way, shape, or form. Because, yeah, he could just keep grabbing it back, and this is probably going to kill him, right? Yep, 20,000 damage. Alright, nice. They need their, so they got their main and the middle. They need the top treasures now. Alright, easy grab here. The flag's already down a lot. Yeah, couldn't do anything. Probably going to run and grab the other flag if they have time. Okay, now they don't need time and they got four treasures pretty nice Let's see how they did MVP again maybe yes MVP again and let's see the score all right five and two 
All right, everybody. We have the final game of Boost for Dark Roger. Okay, not sure what their teammates doing over there. The enemy team. He just uses attack on nothing. But yeah, no one's even coming for the second treasure. All right, that Roger is uh, dead. He is not moving at all. <laughs> sure what he's doing. Kaku, Kaku. Yeah, he probably destroys Kaku, right? Yeah. Alright, who is that? Okay, one of Roger's counters. Nice. One of his direct bounty fest counters. We can see how they fight. Alright. Or he's just gonna grab this and 5 0 them. Okay, Kaku was able to knock him off the flag. Okay, that Roger's moving now. Alright, nice dodge. I wonder if, uh, would he have gotten knocked off or would Kaku just got stunned out of his attack? What is that Roger doing? Roger does not want to help his team at all. Alright, pretty nice. Perfect timing. Shanks was not able to do anything. Oh, that's one shot, Shanks. It might. Ooh, nice dodge. Yeah, Roger's attack is just so hard to see when he's gonna let it go since it lasts so long. I think this is a 5 0 right here. That game lasted almost one minute. Pretty insane. Alright, not bad. 4,800 score just for basically one minute in the game is insane. Now, of course, MVP once again. Roger is insane. And there you go. 3 and 1.